an LNT in the way how Middle East could start contributing again big time? It's already about 30% of the overall revenues. Correct. And like what Nikun said, if you own the LNT and Indian hotel, then for, for maybe one year they did nothing, but suddenly they are up, up almost 50 or 50% 50 or 100%. And LNT still looks the best play on engineering, hydrocarbon, and the electrical space. Along with that, you have ABB, Thermax, or you know, even a company like Voltas, which has a huge presence in the uh, Middle East because of cooling towers. But I would stick with LNT, ABB, and Siemens uh, and Cummins. I think these three are the best capex stocks. They are, the managements have indicated that they are on the roll. They are they are they don't need capital as such. And I think that uh, these are the bellwethers you should uh, own to ride this uh, market. Uh, you also are aware, Ajay, that there is a buyback which is on the card of 3500, where the management is actually exuding confidence. However, like we said, take it with a pinch of salt. These stocks are hitting all-time highs. They are not cheap. So the chances of them being in this consolidation are more rather than uh, immediately giving you returns. Anjeev, uh, any interesting IPO which is there on your radar which you think could be a nice study ship? Uh, Nikunj, uh, since our merchant bankers are involved, I would be difficult for me under compliance to name any uh, new IPO. But there is a whole host of you know fresh entrants for SIPs if you wanted to. But like I said, under compliance, I will not be able to disclose that uh, you know on any stock, any particular new IPO.